Hey tennis fans, I'm Grace Carter and this is Tennis Now presented by Tennis Express. Tennis Express, order today and it ships today. So did anybody expect Yelena Ostapenko to win Roland Garros in 2017? Or how about Sloane Stephens who shocked the world and took home the US Open crown? Or on a smaller scale, Alexander Zarev and Grigor Dimitrov each took home their first Masters 1000 titles in 2017. Can either parlay that success into a triumph on the Grand Slam stage? Well, we know which players made big strides in 2017, but which players are truly ready to win their first Grand Slam next season? So we're going to bring you five players that we think are primed to have maiden major success in 2018. Here we go. Number one, Simona Halep. Halep was oh so close in 2017, holding a set and a break lead over Yelena Ostapenko in the Roland Garros final before falling in three sets. But the Romanian soldiered on and eventually claimed the number one ranking later in the season and finished the year there. Will a Grand Slam title be the next mission accomplished in Halep's career? We think the 26-year-old has all the talent and the drive to get there. Number two is Alexander Zarev. He is a 20-year-old. He finished the year at the number four spot in the world after a season that saw him win 55 matches and take home five titles, including Masters crowns in Rome and in Montreal. Now we think Sasha is primed to take that next step at the majors, despite the fact that he's never reached a major quarterfinal to date. It's gonna happen eventually, so why not in 2018? Number three, Alina Svitolina. She is one of the most consistent players on tour and slowly but surely, Ukraine's number one is developing the weapons that she's gonna need to have success on the Grand Slam stage. Svitolina had a career year in 2017, winning 53 matches and going 11 and four versus the top 10. But she has yet to reach beyond the quarterfinals at a major and owns a 0-5 lifetime record against the top 10 at the Grand Slams. Can she reverse that trend in 2018? We shall see. Number four is Grigor Dimitrov. Is it finally time for Bulgaria's Grigor to climb to the pinnacle of tennis? If 2017 is any indication, the current world number three may indeed be ready. Dimitrov reached his second Grand Slam semi at the Australian Open last January and fell to Rafa Nadal in an epic five-setter. He would go on to compile a 49-14 record with four titles, including a victory at the prestigious ATP World Tour Finals, where he would not drop a set. So Dimitrov earned a career-best eight victories over the top 10 in 2017 and proved that he can shine on the biggest stages in tennis. With a game that prospers on all surfaces, Dimitrov will have chances to go deep at the majors if he can summon that magic that guided him to four titles in 2017, he could end up on the podium at one of them. Number five, Dominique Thiem. The Austrian will be in the mix at Roland Garros for the next 10 years or so, and he's bound to win it one of these years. In fact, we tend to believe that Thiem is gonna be a multiple Roland Garros winner one day. He has won 67 matches on clay over the last three seasons and played nine finals and won six titles. At Roland Garros, he'll face the best of the best, Rafa Nadal, bidding for his 11th title in Paris, and Novak Djokovic should be rounding out into top form by next spring as well. But we think Dominique Thiem has a really good chance to make his major breakthrough on the Terre Batu in 2018. So what do you think? Which of these five players is most likely to win a major next season? And who did we leave off the list? Are you thinking Caroline Wozniacki, maybe Caroline Garcia? How about David Goffin or Lucas Puy? We want to hear from you, so let us know your thoughts in the comment section and we'll check it out. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you next time here on Tennis Now.